I'm sure alam niyo naman na ang gulay or vegetables ay importanteng maging bahagi ng ating daily diet. Pero paano mo malalaman kung paano bumili at pumili ng vegetables? Meron akong isang easy but very valuable tip para sa inyo. Laging tignan na kulay ng gulay. Ang gulay na mas matingkad ang kulay ay ang gulay na mas sustansya. Halimbawa, ang kamatis. Mas okay yung mas mapulang kamatis. Mas konti naman ang vitamina at sustansya ng mas maputlang kamatis. Yung rule na ito applies to almost all kinds of vegetables. O, kaya kapag namalengke kayo, lagi nyo itong isipin. Before we start, make sure you have an area that's safe and wear clothes you can work out in. Breathing before the warm-up. Breathe slow and relax. Now, inhale and exhale. Feel the breath. Move your lungs. For the warm-up, let's start with the march for 16 counts. March. Let's move our feet. Just feel the groove and march to the beat. Let's march four steps forward and four steps backward. Let's move it forward and move it back. Let's move big and feel warm. Move relaxed and move within your pace. Side to side. Now let's move side to side. Para step close lang yan. While you're going side to side, swing your arms sideways. Relax. Just go with the beat. Feel it. Side to side, forward and back. Now let's move it side to side, but go forward and back. Kung gusto nyo, pwede nyo isayaw. So you're going four steps forward, four steps backward. Kung gusto nyo isayaw, gusto nyo lagyan ng konting ingat, you can make your steps bigger. Iwasan lang natin na tumatalon. Then we go to the leg curl. Let's do this also for 16 counts. Leg curl in place before the knee elbow. Curl your leg, feel the beat. When curling your leg, do a pulling action with your arms. Sabay nyo lang sa legs ninyo, nararamdaman ninyo to sa hita ninyo. Parang sinisipa nyo yung puwet nyo na sariling paano. And now let's do the leg curl forward and back. Leg curl forward and back. Let's continue doing the leg curl, but this time moving forward and moving back. So it's four counts moving forward and four counts moving back. Make sure you are in control of your movement to avoid injury. And now the knee elbow. Knee elbow. Bring the knee to your elbow, but avoid jerky movement. Pasagawin nyo lang yung kaya nyo yung galaw. Gusto nyo itaas yung tuod, angat ninyo, ingat lang na huwag masyadong kukuba. O gusto nyo mababa lang yung tuod, okay lang yun. Basta umiinit kayo at masasayaw nyo, na-enjoy nyo yung workout. Knee elbow forward and back. Let's do the knee elbow but this time, forward and then move back. Kung gusto nyo matawisan, exaggerate your movement. If you plan to exaggerate, make sure you don't arch too much or crunch down. Make sure na ayos na ayos yung forma ninyo. Para safe tayo palagi. Now, let's do the grapevine. Grapevine. Isipin nyo na lang, four steps to the right, four steps to the left. Don't forget to breathe and move correctly. Be in control. And to round up the warm-up exercise, let's do the step taps. Step tap. Now, let's slow down and do the step tap. Slow down and get ready for the march. And that was the warm-up, guys. Can you feel the energy? Simula pa lang yan. The next part is the stretching. Karamihan sa sugar o asukal na nabibili natin sa groceries ay refined na. This means na babawasan ang mga nutrients na nakulang na binibigay sa atin ng sugar cane. Kapag refined ng sugar, parang empty calories na rin. Walang binibigay na nutisyon ang pataba pa. Kaya't ang tip ko sa inyo, gumamit ng alternative sa sugar. Mas healthy na, mas masarap pa. Pwede kayong gumamit ng honey, 
maple syrup, fruit juice, or brown sugar. When you're on a diet, here are some tips. Sit down when you eat. Chew your food well. Eat slowly. Nam namin ang bawat subo. Stretching is the second part of the workout because it loosens and prepares the body for the workout. Dapat sa stretching ay slow at relaxed ang paghinga. And always check your body alignment para masiguradong tama ang stretching na ginagawa nyo. And lastly, feel the stretch. Let's march again. March with a breathe. Now let's march and breathe. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now let's get ready for the stretch. Now let's stretch. Let's start with the forearms and the rib cage. Overhead stretch. Palms out and reach up to the sky. Feel the stretch on your arms and your rib cage. Breathe deep and relax. Then let's take the head down. Next stretch down. Hold the back of your head and bring your head down. Be gentle when you pull your head down. Feel the stretch on your neck and don't forget to breathe. Then take the head to the side. Next stretch to the right and to the left. Put your right hand over your head and pull your head to the right shoulder. You're going to feel the stretch on the side of your neck and you're also going to do it on the other side. So you put your left hand over your head and bring it to your left shoulder. Then we go to the tricep stretch. Tricep stretch. Bring your right elbow to the back of your head, hold it with your left hand, and pull the arm to the back of your head. Now let's do it on the other side. Chin up, and just pull within your range. Let's hit the shoulders and the back. Shoulder stretch. Now bring one arm across the body, hold it from below, and hug it. Now let's do it on the other side. Wag ka kalimutan dapat niyo maramdaman sa shoulders at sa inyong likod. And don't forget to breathe and smile. Now we do the chest. Chest stretch. Now bring your hands behind you and pull your shoulders back and push your chest out. Feel the stretch and breathe. Hold. Then we go down to the torso and twist. Torso twist. Now bend down, hold your thighs, push them open, and drop your right shoulder and look up to the sky. Feel the stretch and breathe. Let's do it on the other side. Mararamdaman nyo ito sa likod at sa dewa. Relax. Huwag kakalimutang huminga. Now curl the torso and then arch. Torso stretch contracted. Galing sa stretch na nakatwist kayo, ibabalik nyo sa harap, sa gitna, ikukuba nyo ang likod ninyo. Titingin kayo ng konti sa baba. Mararamdaman yung stretch na yan sa likod. Sarap. Torso stretch, arch. Ngayon, pagkagaling sa kuba, umiyad naman kayo. Tingin sa harap. Chin up, chest out. Mararamdaman nyo ito sa ribcage. Napakasarap na itong stretch na ito para sa likod. Then, let's go to the legs and stretch the hamstring. Hamstring stretch. Stand straight, hold your hips, take out your right heel, put it in front, Push your buttocks back and feel the stretch on your hamstrings. Don't forget to keep your toes up and the other leg bent. And then, tuwing din natin sa kabilang side. Now, 
Now stretch the quads. Standing quad stretch. Take the right foot with your left hand behind you and pull. Feel the stretch on your quad. If it's difficult for you to balance, maghanap ng pader o silya kung saan kayo pwedeng umawa. Tapos, also do it on the other side. And for the last one, our calves. Standing calf stretch. Now bring your right leg back. Make sure the right foot is flat on the floor and all your toes are pointing forward. Push your hips in forward and feel the stretch on your right calf. Now let's do it on the other side. Don't forget to push your hips forward, okay? Now breathing after the stretch. Inhale deep and exhale deep. Get ready for the main workout. Exhale. One more inhale and exhale and done. Ha! Oh, di ba ang sarap ng pakiramdam? Now your body is ready for the main workout.